think we'd be down five, six, eight, whatever it is. So regardless what the score is, I know this team's going to continue to fight back. Yeah, I'm, I mean, it was tough, you know, at the end, you know, they make that three, kind of a breakdown. We probably got to watch it to see what really happened. But, um, you know, we just stayed together. I just trying to keep our spirits high, you know. If we just, you know, gave up after that three and we wouldn't have been able to rally in overtime. So I think we did a good job of just keeping our head and the fans were giving us life at the end too. So, Yeah, I guess they, they hadn't t- taken the lead till overtime. Um, there was a turnover. I think, like I said, a turnover, and they, they converted it. I mean, what were you guys thinking at that point? Because they, they, you know, come back from 16 down. What kind of what was the mindset? Yeah, just like what I said, we seen everything. So we just knew that we were going to continue to fight back. It happened at the beginning of the OT, I'm pretty sure, right, at the beginning of OT. So so there's plenty of time left on the clock. We knew we were going to fight back. That was, you know, they in by, you know Jalen in by the ball to Devo there with five or whatever there was left. Five, five point five, and I think okay, they're gonna follow Devo, and then they, for whatever reason, they couldn't get to him, and he got ahead to you. I mean, just what did y'all see from that play? And Stanley, did you think about taking, you know, not taking it to the hole and just dribbling it out? Or just nah, nah, to... I, I, you know, he got me. He got me the ball, you know, uh, and I had a good angle. I knew I was gonna be able to get to the rim, so at least draw a foul if, if anything. So, you know, I just took it straight into the rim, and the rest was what it was. He shut the lights off. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, they didn't follow Devo. Maybe they just couldn't react fast enough. No, nah, Devo fast. Yeah, fast. I, knew, I knew they weren't going to catch him. It was a great game. pass, too. Yeah, so he he just, was, so. Great pass. You had another double double, 14 and 11. Mm-hmm. And then you had six steals tonight, too. That's I mean, different. what's the feeling of putting up those numbers in a game in, in an atmosphere like this? It felt like you were kind of fading off the crowd, too. Man, I'm, I just try to do whatever it takes to win. My teammates know that that's how I play. And regardless of what my stats are, they know that I'm going to do whatever it takes for them uh, or for us to win the game. So I guess I just had a good night and the crowd was amazing. We fed off them the whole game. So they were our, like, they were our teammate the whole game. Just the crowd was amazing. Uh, Jalen, you were down there for a little bit at the end. Was, was that an ankle? What was going on there with you? No, I was catching cramps in both calves. <laughs> Twenty-two you know, minutes, man. Um, as, as far as the game, you guys have won four in a row now. You've won by 40, 41 in overtime. Just kind of what, just what, what's your reaction to this role you y'all are on right now? Yeah, uh, obviously it's, it's a lot more fun when when we're winning. When we're winning, so that's the first thing. You know, we're having a lot more fun playing together, and we, we're we're obviously more excited for each other whenever we're making plays out there. You could you could tell we're feeding off of each other's energy. So, I think you know we just got to keep it going, keep preparing like how we've been preparing, and and we'll just let the rest take care of itself. Yeah, kind of what Stan said. We just got to keep adding on to it, keep getting better, regardless of if we're playing our best. We can always get better. So we just got to keep adding to it, keep rolling. Stan, I think this was the first time that you played in this building when it's like really, really full, uh, go for 15, seven, three steals. Could you just describe what it was like playing in this environment and then kind of walk me through the the dunk at the end? I'm sure that had to feel pretty good. Uh, it's, it's, it's crazy playing in this environment. You know, growing up, I, I always dreamed about playing, you know, watching college basketball games. This is the environment that I, I pictured myself playing in. So it's 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 a dream come true, I, I can say. And, and it's 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 fun, you know, playing in front of all those fans. It just gives you a different edge, and 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 it just really helps us in the end. So, and the the dunk, I, you know, like I said earlier, Devo get threw me a great pass. I had a good step on the guy and just took off. <laughs> I thought the game was over. <laughs> I thought it was game. Hey, what do you guys think of Taylor? He had twenty five for them. Um, what what freshman? What what do you guys think of him? Uh, he didn't catch us by a surprise. I would say like, he had he played good, but we were we we knew that that he comes in off the bench, ready to you know spark the game up and and change the tempo. He he just he made a couple big shots and he stepped up to the plate. You know he's a good player. Yeah, for a freshman, he's a really confident player. He's a great player. He came in hot at the beginning of the game. I think he was five and five at halftime or yeah. something like that. But he's a great player. He changes the tempo for their team. I don't have the box. But I think you guys were shooting shot around thirty five percent. You start off really hot. You know, hitting I don't know seven to ten or something. Well, what happened after that hot start? Was it just something they were doing, or something you guys weren't doing, or what? What happened with the shooting? Um, basketball just gave a run. Shots are gonna fall. Shots are gonna miss. So I think it's just the flow of the game, and we picked it back up in the second half. I feel like we had a really great start with the second half to get the score back going for us. But it's just basketball. Stanley, what did you, you start off pretty hot too. What did you think of the way that the offense kind of? 
Like Jay Will said, I think in the beginning, you know, we were all, we were all, we came out ready to play, which is a good thing. You know, it's a good thing we got that lead. So, you know, if we didn't, it probably would have been uh, harder to win the game there at the end. So, you know, I think it's just game of runs. We missed a couple shots. We were still moving the ball. I think when we move the ball, we get our best shots. So we just got to focus on not going through those scoring drops. We're up, you know, I say I think it was 20 to four or something. Were you thinking it was going to be like another Missouri game? That's kind of what went through my mind. But obviously A&M, you know, fought back. Yeah, um, kind of the same thing happened last game when we played them. I'm pretty sure we got off to a hot start against them, and and we knew that they they were going to fight back again. So going up 20 or four, we knew the game wasn't over yet. We wanted to keep fighting, and they fought back. So we just we want, they showed us a thing in practice the other day that we're one of the teams that get we have a lot of runs and we get off a lot of runs. So we knew that we had to stop the run and we had to start ours up. Yeah, you know, Jalen, you made a shot. Uh, put I think it was seventy four seventy one on a Big pass shot. from Chris Likes. Can you Big kind of shot. take us through that sequence? It wasn't much time on the shot clock, I don't think. Yeah, um, Chris had an ISO at the top of the top of the lane or top of the key, and I just knew that he was going to get a bucket. But he, uh, I think he slipped or lost the ball a little bit, and I just filled up and he gave it to me, and the, I just shot it. I'm, I have confidence in myself, and I'm, I know my teammates have confidence in me shooting that shot. I work on it every day. And, I just had confidence, took the shot, and then went in. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Ah.